Today I'm going to show you how to upload a file to Mediafire Drop File. For today's example, I have the file placed on my desktop. It doesn't matter where your file is as long as you know where it's at. I'm using an audio file, but other types of files will work just as well. Next, you need to get your file drop link from your email. More than likely, you will be able to click on it, but if not, select the link, copy it, and then open your browser. In this example, I'll be using Chrome, but you're welcome to use any browser you like, and they should all work without any problems. If you are having problems, trying a different browser is, should be the first step. Once you have your browser open, paste it into the address bar and press enter on your keyboard, and this will bring up the file drop site. This link is reusable, so you can bookmark the link for later use, and then all you have to do is, instead of copy and pasting the link, you can just click on the bookmark and you can bring up the site again. Now there are two ways of uploading a file to the file drop site. I'll show you both of them. We'll start with the first way which is to drag and drop the file. So we'll move our window out of the way and then we'll go over to where our file is on our desktop and we'll drag it in to the media fire and click start upload. This box is to add a description. It's better to put important information about the file in the name of the file and not in this description box because it is easier to see once it is uploaded to Mediafire and it is easier to keep track of the files. You can just leave the box empty and press OK. Now the file is going to upload. If you have another file to upload, you could click Upload Another File. But for this example, I don't, but I will show you how to do it the second way, so I will click it anyway. Now we're back to the screen we had before, and this time I'll click Select File. Now I need to find the file wherever it is located on my computer, in this case desktop, so I will navigate to the desktop folder, and click on the file to select it. You can also select multiple files by holding down the control key on your keyboard, and then selecting all the files you like. But in this case, I only want to upload the one, so I will click the one I want to upload and click open. And now I will click start upload. And once again, I have the description box and now we're uploading the file. How long it takes to upload the file depends on your internet connection and the size of the file. My internet connection must have slowed way down here because before it uploaded in just a second. A larger file of two or three gigabytes may take a few hours to upload. If it does take a few hours to upload, it's best to just put the browser at the bottom of the screen and try not to use the internet as much as possible while it's uploading so that way it doesn't get interrupted. Once again, the file has completed uploading. This concludes the example. If you have any problems or questions, please feel free to leave a comment, and I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you.